Hey YouTube, what's going on? This is iTalk. Update day for the Wii Shopping Channel. Here, and in today's video, we have a brand new video. So today we're gonna be talking about two things that Fortnite actually mentioned to us here over on their own Twitter and on their own website. So the first thing we're gonna talk about today is the final wild week that we have here for chapter two, season six. They say it's time for the bargain bin clearance event in this final wild week of chapter two, season six, which by the way, won't be lasting an entire week. I don't think it'd be lasting until Tuesday. Island vendors are offering big, big savings. All bar balances will be reset at the start of the next season. So take advantage of these huge deals to deplete your bar balance to zero because yes, there is really no point in keeping your bars for next season because it will reset anyway. What deals can you look forward to? Through the end of the season, all exotics and many services are 50% off. The exotic marksman six shooter, 50% off. The exotic grappler bow, 50% off. Bush Rangers Prop Disguise Service, 50% off. Don't undervalue this increase in purchasing power. Bargain Bin will keep clearing stock until downtime begins for Chapter 2 Season 7, happening June 8th, 2021. The Island Vendors thank you for your business. So there you go with that, guys. Make sure you spend all your bars because for this final week, you do have a quest to complete where you have to spend 750 bars, but you can do that alongside with your squad. So that shouldn't be really that hard to do. But regardless of that, that is what we have for this final week of this season. But finally, this is some really big news here. Fortnite on PC is to be upgraded visuals in the version 17 update. They say when Chapter 2 Season 7 arrives next week, Fortnite on PC will receive upgraded visuals. While running epic graphics settings on a machine that meets system requirements, you'll be able to enjoy new and enhanced effects plus improved post-processing features and shadow quality. Starting with Chapter 2 Season 7, if you play with your quality presets option set to epic, you'll notice that both Battle Royale and Creative Modes benefit from improved storm and cloud effects, as well as enhanced simulations for smoke and liquid. What's that mean? Expect clear looking explosion, fire, and slurp effects. Speaking of cool, the changes will include improved post-processing features for bloom and lens flares, as well as improved shadow quality. When Fortnite released on the new generation of consoles in 2020, it introduced more advanced explosion effects. These advanced effects will arrive on PC in the version 17 update. That is awesome to hear. Because of these upgrades, Epic settings will require higher device specifications to run with optimal performance. High settings will become the equivalent of the pre-version 17 Epic settings. So your experience with high settings may change depending on your specifications. So if you don't understand what that means, basically what we have for Epic settings on PC right now will actually go to be high settings after the version 17 update. So Epic settings are gonna be even better, but high settings will be the Epic settings that we have right now for PC. Low and medium settings, as well as the performance rendering mode alpha will remain the same within the release of version 17. 17, so that's good. With the upgrades to Epic Quality presets, we've added the system requirements category for running Epic settings optimally. The Epic Quality preset specifications are not replacing the recommended specifications. So here's what we have for the Epic Quality preset specifications. We have all this right here. I'll just leave this on the screen for you guys. And they also say below are the recommended and minimum PC specifications for Fortnite. Unrelated to the new visual changes, the recommended GPU will become NVIDIA GTX 960, AMD R9 280, or equivalent DX11 GPU when version 17 releases. So that seems better. That actually doesn't seem too hard to actually reach those requirements. Also, we're changing the official recommended OS to Windows 10 64-bit, but please note that players on Windows 7 64-bit and Windows 8 64-bit can still run Fortnite at optimal performance. So yeah, they definitely want you to upgrade to Windows 10, it seems like, because that is the official recommendation, but they do say that you can still play it on Windows 7 or Windows 8. Whatever happened to Windows 9? We never ended up getting that. I don't, I don't think we did. So here's the other specifications there. And then finally, with version 17 update, we hope you enjoy the upgraded visuals of Fortnite on PC. And guys, that's it for this short little video today. Sorry it wasn't a long one, but... There wasn't really much else to talk about. We're all really excited for this next season. We're just anticipating it at this point. Expect Aurelia in the item shop tonight, by the way. It would make total sense for her to release. I'm expecting a TikTok emote on Friday, and we'll probably get a new set on Saturday. I'm expecting a lot of new stuff to come into the item shop for quite a bit because we have a lot of stuff that have not been released yet, and we'll probably see them for the next season, most likely. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. If you did, let me know to like and subscribe to the channel if you're brand new, and turn on the bell just so you get all my latest uploads. And if you like to me for support a creator my code is itf y'all have yourselves a fantastic day or night everyone see ya